All right, it is almost Super Bowl Sunday and the LA Rams will take on the Cincinnati Bengals and kickoff is at 3 30 p.m. Pacific time. So take a look at this. This is a live look that we're going to take a look at at SoFi Stadium in LA. Look at it all beautiful and glorious. Get this. This is actually the second time a team will play the Super Bowl in their home stadium. Pretty cool. So when it comes to Super Bowl, it's all about the numbers, not just on the field, but also off the field too. So a new report from Wallet Hub breaks down some of the fun facts about this year's game. And Jeremy? Oh, 17 <laughs> million. That's the estimated number of Americans who will call out the day after the Super Bowl? <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, Woo, oh, I don't feel uh, good. Yeah, uh, <clears throat> all right. Uh, guess how much it costs? That, that little fact, that costs an estimated $4 billion for loss of productivity for companies. I'm just saying, make the day after a Super Bowl a holiday. We'll all it's be fine. Thing. It's a thing. It's a thing. Now get this, over 8,000. That's the average number of calories that people <gasps> will consume at a Super Bowl yeah, party. Buddy. Why do we got to lead with the bad news first? I know. Like, come on, don't. Yeah, I did not want to know that. Mm -mm. Nope, not at all. <laughs> well, some other big ticket items for those Super Bowl parties. More than 49 million cases of beer will wow. be sold. Beer. Yeah, a lot Burr. of people are will be a little turned. <laughs> <laughs> Americans will eat over 1.4 billion chicken wings. That's wow. a lot yeah, of buddy. chicken. That's, that's what I'm about. And can you oh, guess yeah. how many pounds of guac? It's there on your screen. Oh Eight million pounds of wow. guac. That so is my, a lot of avocados. My mom yesterday was like, why don't you just make guacamole for your Super Bowl party? And I was like, mom, do you think there are good avocados available this late in the game? Oh, oh that so is that, true. Yeah, Everybody's true. gotten all the good avocados. Might be too late. Okay. Also, the, more than 11 million pounds of potato chips are consumed Jeez. as well. Yeah. We're oh, a part of the problem. We are a part of the problem. <laughs> yeah. So if you take a look here right now, this morning our Up With Creme team members bought in their Super Bowl dishes and yeah. we'll have them all laid out here. You Jeremy's are done already? Yeah. It's so crazy. We're working on it. We're working on it. Right, it's a work right. in progress. So yeah. if you want to know what we're cooking up, you can text the word recipe to 509-448-2000 and we will send you our favorite Super Bowl snacks that we like to munch on during the big game. Yeah, so as you can see, Jeremy is still preparing. What are you making? Dish. Listen, I'm making ham and cheese sandwiches that Those I'm going great. to warm oh. up. This is, look at this. So oh, with take the, the buns. Yeah, Yum. so you take the Hawaiian rolls. Yes. I'm supposed to have a 9 by 13 pan. I don't. So okay. basically cut it in half, fill it with ham and cheese. Yeah. Love it. Okay, let's show you what else is on the spread though. We yes. have our photographer Al's famous seven layer bean dip. Mm. And then over here is my buffalo dip. It's not done famous. yet. I gotta pop it back in the oven and famous. add some more <laughs> toppings. And then Channing, what else do we have? Okay, so I made my famous Channing's chicken bites. We have Katie's Ooh. queso, and we even have fried pickles. So in just a bit coming up in our next half hour, we're gonna be trying all this deliciousness. Mm. And if you wanna eat with us, yeah, text us 509-448-2000. We'll send all of these recipes right to you. And let us know what's in your spread.